love. And it's Jesus. Hey, hey, hey. Listen, can I can I talk to you? Don't don't worry about this guy. He, 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 okay. All right, listen, guys. A very quick one. Yes. This place said, "Listen, you would know." Jesus said, "Unless you're born of my Spirit, you cannot enter heaven." John chapter three, verse three. Whenever anybody says, "I'm a Christian," out of caring, I'm not saying this is you, but some people put a label on themselves and they say, "I'm a Christian," and I say, "Why?" and they go, "Oh well, I went to a Catholic church, or I, you know, I, I read the Bible, or I fed the poor." Doesn't cut it. It's only what Jesus has done, isn't it? That's it. So what I do is, I affirm this with people on the street, because you got to get this 100% right, not partially right. It's got to be absolutely right. And he said, if you confess me before man, I'll confess you before my Father in heaven. Yeah. Correct. Okay. So let's. I have a quick prayer with me and just pray, and ask Jesus to affirm that in heaven that your whole family, everyone gets safe in His hand. Yeah. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's all do it. I love it when families do this. And listen, you are a good man. You're the head of your house. That's beautiful. I love it. He's a good... Take after dad, all right? That's and you never be embarrassed of your faith. Never. All right. Let's bow our head. Let's look away to Jesus. And let's say, Heavenly Father. Heavenly Father. I ask Jesus into my life. Come in and wash away all my sin. Give me all your righteousness. I believe you died for me and that you rose again. I turn away from my sin. I give you my life. And according to your word, I am now born of your spirit. In Jesus' name. Amen. Hey, you're a great family. I love you guys.